Hey there Airsoft fans, John Matrix here with a review of the Matrix Aim Top M4 Sports Line. Sold at evike.com. Uh, that's their logo right there. I've seen a bunch of reviews of the all metal one of this uh, gun and this this is, will be a review of the plastic body sports line version of this um, this is the box that came in pretty uh, pretty nice decorative box uh, nothing too fancy on the inside came with a cleaning and unjamming rod all in black came with a adjustable a tool for your adjustable front sight came with this manual right by AIMTOP uh, it's got several different guns in here with lots of good information okay so here's the gun this gun right off the bat it's got some really good weight to it really solid feeling gun um, I thought it would be lighter honestly so um, I was pretty uh, I was pretty impressed this this weighs at least five pounds um, um, it, it's got some real weight to it um, okay let's start off with metal flash hider 14 millimeter negative thread if you're going to remove it don't forget to remove the hex nut in there before you can remove the metal flash hider it's got a metal two-part barrel you can interchange and make different lengths on the barrel if you like got a metal front sight now when I got this gun uh, this metal front sight was a little loose all I had to do was uh, tighten up the hex nut on the bottom there and now it's rock solid uh, the hand grip is plastic the delta ring is metal and it's got a nice nice good fit to it it's pretty tight um, first few times I opened this up it's uh, it's a uh, you know it takes a little bit of practice but it's pretty good uh, some people have commented that there's too much wobble on here well it's got a little bit of wobble but it's it's fine I mean uh, once I tighten up once I tighten this up here the front sight it was fine uh, plastic receiver uh, this I put on myself this is a sling I put on myself so that that, that did not come with the gun plastic receiver Special Forces logo, I think it's pretty cool. Um, metal bolt catch, it's a little loose, but no big deal. The uh, release for the mag is metal here. Uh, the carry handle is plastic, but it has metal knobs. There's uh, your typical two apertures and uh, elevation and windage adjustments. There's a metal buffer tube and there is a six position stock now I've heard some comments about this gun saying that uh, this stock is too wobbly all you gotta do is just tighten up this nut right here to the right it came, it came a little looser so I tighten it up and voila gee the wobble is very minute now so don't forget to do that when you get yours the uh, selector switch is metal also very nice crisp click I like it a lot metal trigger metal trigger guard plastic handle this is nice plastic this this actually looks like it's metal um, I mean, it might be hard to tell with the video camera but uh, this this looks like it's metal it, it, it's plastic but it's nice plastic again oh and of course the mag is metal uh, flip this around to the other side you got a metal forward assist non-functional doesn't do anything just for looks your metal pin to take apart your gun uh, the mag release is metal and this uh, dust cover is metal I mean I'm sorry it's plastic now I've heard a lot of comments about the metal version of this gun saying that uh, you pull back the uh, charging handle and uh, the dust cover doesn't open I've had this gun for a week without exception every time I pull that charging handle that baby pops open just like it's supposed to not a problem pulling this back of course exposes the uh, adjustable hop-up and 
what else can I tell you about this gun? Well, okay, when you try to release the mag, this, this is the mag, it says aim top, this is the mag that came with the gun, when you push the button to release it, it does not drop out, because it's a really tight fit in there. You can shake it a little bit, and then it comes out. Now I have, I put other mags in here, and uh, other mags do come out uh, by themselves, but uh, the mag that came with this gun, it's just, you know, it's really, really tight fit in there. Um, that uh, kind of hugs it in there, and uh, it's fine. It, it, it's it's actually pretty nice. Um, handguard is like I said, uh, takes a little work to uh, open up. Um, I bought uh, this Tenergy 9.6 volt, 2,000 milliamp custom battery. This is real easy to put that in there. I mean, this is just over simple. I mean, you pop this in there and, and there's no problem. So, uh, this is nice. This was only $23 at Evike. Um, this gun, it's got uh, an internal metal 8mm gearbox from Aimtop. The, the gearbox costs $110. The entire gun costs 115, so that's pretty awesome. Uh, additionally, this gun comes with a tight bore barrel, internal barrel. Okay. So you've got an M100 spring in here, metal gearbox. Um, it's it's uh, it's quoted to shoot about 360 to 400 feet per second. I have not taken it to the field yet. I will and, and post that um, once I do. But I'll tell you right now, this shoots at least 360 at least 360 this is incredible this 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 shoots really really well now for the price I was look I was in the market for an M4 I wanted a metal gearbox plastic body I didn't want to spend a million dollars the closest gun that I found price wise to this gun is the G&G GR16 that gun is $140 that gun does not have a type 4 barrel and that gun does not shoot as hard as this gun so again, this gun, the Matrix M4 Sports Line M100, cost I, I got it several months ago, and it was on pre-order. It was only $100 back then. Now it's $115, but it's still a steal. $115 for this gun, and Evike has these holy cow deals where they give you for an extra $3, they give you two high cap metal magazines. Okay, so for $123, you get three three mags and the M4. Uh, you can't beat that. Oh, did I mention they give you free shipping? You t you punch in the uh, coupon code, free ship. You get free shipping as long as the order is over $100. So uh, I searched around, tried to find better deals. I, I have not been able to. So these guys are great. I don't know how they do it, but hey, you know. They must have some secret somewhere. I don't know. Anyway, um, anything else I can tell you about this gun? Um, I like it. I like it a lot. It's really cool. Like I said, it shoots really hard. Um, and I also bought this really cool gun bag at Evike for 20 bucks. It's very nice. Soft interior. Lots of room. This this gun fits in completely folded out, expanded. It fits right in here, and it's got five mag pouches. Um, I've seen some gun bags uh, for fifteen dollars other places, but not ones that have gun mags. So twenty bucks. This is a steal. Also, I think this is great. So, well, I guess that's it for now. Uh, when I get to go to the field, I will definitely uh, bring my camera shoot this and uh, show you how uh, how hard it shoots so until then guys take it easy check out evike.com they got some great sales great holy cow deals all the time and uh, make, make, make some comments give me some comments down below till next time